The master weavers of Randela. Come, come, feel its softness. Chocobo Make a nice steaks, gift Chocobo for your wife. Sausage. Chocobo Three steaks, you fucking worms. savage. None of the old courses you'll find elsewhere. Here, take a bite. Chocobo sausage, you guys are fucked up, bro. I've got peppers and peas, beans and beets. If it goes peppers to the and peas. Pot, I've got the lot. Curatives, restoratives. Look all you like, sir. Poultices. It's all fresh. Pick this very morning. Restoratives. Unguents, ointments, poultices. Palmatives, curatives, restoratives. Palmatives, curatives, restoratives. Palmatives, curatives, restoratives. <laughs> Take interest you in a potion, my lady. Restoratives. A soothing salve to ease the aches of the road. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I wish you well, but may the mothers guide you. Damn, she said fuck off. Comptives, <laughs> curatives, restoratives. Comptives, curatives, restoratives, anyone? Someone in the chat, maybe? Comment section? Five years later, oh shit! Year of the Realm 878, so we've had yet another time skip. Comptives, curatives, and restoratives. You, Sid. What have we learned? A new Sid? Victor, a friend of Sid's and later Clive's, who keeps an ever, uh, what? An ever attentive vigil on the comings and goings of Dalmechia from his hometown of Kos Nice. The bearers of the curatives and restoratives, guys. At the edge of town. And I hardly need tell you who is there to make sure they stay that way. Kupka's private guard. It's so now trip. we're in Kupka land. And not the Dalmechia. a good one at that. Another. What does he hope to gain from this? I'll have the captives free before nightfall. He probably just thinks you Sid's been like eluding him for all this time. Rage didn't give their lives for you to get your throat slit in a god's forsaken slum. So those in the courthouse should be left to suffer. That's not what I said. I simply meant it doesn't have to be you who frees them. Yes, but comptives, curatives, and restoratives. You don't understand. You're as stubborn as the old Sid was. Yeah, he bitched him out without even saying a word. That's crazy. <laughs> this is nuts. He didn't say nothing. He just mad dogged them. <laughs> he just folded. Just don't say I didn't warn you. You're Sid now. And if anything happens to him, we're finished. So we took up the mantle of Sid. Oh shit, like even in name. Don't forget to get your comptives, curatives, and restoratives before you leave, though, Sid. Come on. What are you doing? So does he think he, when he was blacking out or whatever that he saw Joshua, did he think it was a dream? Does he Is he now in contact with him? Like, we don't know. But I, what I do know is that I need comptives, curatives, and preserve, or restoratives. Sorry. We'd help you if we could. Oh <laughs> no! You're helping us already. <laughs> that man's sword looked horrible. It looked so dusty. He did not mean to offend. Quiet, you. No sign of Hugo. I'll wager he thinks as highly of his minions' traps as we do. Then this should be easy. Don't hurt us. I beg of you. Quiet means quiet, branded scum. Damn. So now we should have Ramless power though, because we did get his dominant before he died. Which is a very clutch of Sid, to be honest. It's going to be alright. Yeah. I've brought comptives, curatives, and restoratives. You're gonna be okay. Any objections? It's him! The outlaw. Sid's here! The outlaw, Sid, yeah, that's fucking cool. We've taken up his mantle, man. Come on. 
It probably only hurt. He has lightning powers. That's all you need to know. Summon the others. <laughs> We're gonna fight him, but go. <laughs> Get him. Safe. All right. The power of thunder. Five has claimed a portion of the icon Ramos essence. So yeah, it's portions of it. We get portions. Okay. Attuning with Ramon not only changes the elemental aspects of class magic spells, but also allows access to several new iconic abilities, such as Thunderstorm, which rains Levin Bolts down on all nearby enemies, knocking them back. Abilities details are found in the Abilities tab in the main menu. To be fair, I think Sid's death could have been a lot sadder, like if he fucking turned the stone or something. That would have been, oh my god, that would have been heart-wrenching. The way he went out, though, like he went, he went fighting against whatever the fuck Typhon is, so can't really fault him on that either. He's like some otherworldly being, maybe one of the fallen. It, Joshua said that his name is Ultima, so... Rama's feet. Rama's iconic feet, Blind Justice, can be used to launch a barrage of lightning bolts up to nine targets. Uh, barrage of ball lightning, sorry. Determined by locking onto them, the lightning will temporarily remain affixed to the target and can be ignited by striking it. It can be ignited by striking it. So hit them and then they start burning on fire too, or... Looks like. Oh. Okay, oh, okay, so you, you hit it with magic. How do we do that? How do we do that? What button is it? Oh, here we go. How do you do it? Press circle again. So try thunderstorm out. Oh, it places it like right where I fucking uh Ooh the power drive is nice. This guy's getting obliterated with <laughs> a little lightning spell right there. Oh, and you can hit every single one of them. Okay. Damn. They coming at us. How many are there? Titan sent his regards. Titan sent his regards. They're getting fucked up, bro. <laughs> Oh, okay. Got your ass. Where do you think you're Give going? Me thunder. Give me thunder. Enough of this. Kupka's private guard Let's again. Play with the kitten. Play with the kitten, hey yo. They brought a pet. Some sort of like panther or something. Kinda looks like a panther, right? You'll pay for what you've done, Sid. Those things are fast. We'll have to be faster. Like a panther, jaguar, Republican war panther, yes. Nice, already staggered. Towards the end, we'll go ahead and use the tornado. Here we go. Get his ass! And he's fully staggered, let's go! That's 
Let's fucking go. We're going crazy right now. Uppercut his ass. Partial stagger. Popple him. Got him. The War Panther has been slain. Damn, we got a lot of fucking gill. Got some decent ability points there, and we got the lightning shard. The power of the icon Rama made manifest. The crystal or the shard of crystal tingles the palm and can be heard to emit a soft hum when held to the ear. Oh, why did he up on his hind legs? That's weird. Now come at me. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. They'll tell Hugo. Let them. There's been more than enough bloodshed for one day. For real. The people we saved, the bears. I wonder if we have a new hideout or not now. Murderer. All of our friends are dead because of you. Do you hear me? They used us as bait. Bait to lure you out of your stinking hole. All because you couldn't just let things be. What are you even doing here? <laughs> we never asked to be saved. Did you think we'd thank you? They'll never forgive us. We're all marked now. <laughs> Big man. I knew it was going to be like this when he fucking oh, spat on the floor. As we fought to secure a better life for our kind. To see that we are treated as equals. Do you not want that? What we want is to be left alone. Every time you show your faces, it is we who suffer. I mean, they have a point. Like, they're going to be fucked with even more now. I'm sorry. Just leave us be. This is our home, and this is where we will stay. Sid told us this wouldn't be easy. They'll come round. Uh, you hope they will, but... I don't know, man. We should go. I mean, he did say it would be a lot harder than it would be easier at the start. All right. Our new hideout, maybe? <clears throat> All these old points are not allowed anymore. Probably later on they'll be allowed. Just right now we gotta go where the story's telling us. Return to the hideaway. See, I think it used to be like right here, no? Amongst the unfading remnants of ambitions long forgotten... Oh, what the fuck? Do Clive and his companions forge a path for a better tomorrow? Oh, so maybe it's even in the old hideout. They just, like, rebuilt it. Oh, shit. <clears throat> Let's see what we got here. I wonder if people, like, goats... Is goats still alive? Is... Benemir, Central Storm. Like it's, yeah, is Goat still ago. alive? What about Mar uh, Karen? For many was a symbol of hope. For a reason they'll never know. We cannot blame them for thinking us the cause of their misery. Yeah, and they didn't even... The fucked up part is they were all like, Where's Sid? And they didn't even know Sid had gone out on a mission. And all of a sudden they were all fucked. Them a better tomorrow. They see only that we've made their lives harder today. Yeah, a lot of people are short-sighted that way. Me included sometimes. If it is to heal. I can't help but wonder if we've made the right choice. That is fair. 
When Sid said that he wanted to create a world where we were free. Free to choose our own path. I honestly don't think it mattered to him if that choice was right or wrong. Only that it was our own. I miss him. <laughs> a world where we can live and die as equals. That's what he wanted. What we want. And that's why I bear his name. It's okay. why we've all chosen to bear his legacy. And... I'm not going to let anything stand in our way. Who's that? Tides over, lovebirds. Home sweet home. Obelisk, the boatman. The hideaway, and we're in water now. We're not on the land, we're on the water. Made like some makeshift thing out of one of the starships. Or whatever they were, the flaw the ships that they used to have the fallen. I'm assuming that's what that is, right? Home sweet home. Otto was asking after you. Let's go and see him. So Otto's still alive. Last I saw, he was in the mess as All right. A new hideout. Welcome back, Sid. Finish with that log so we can call it a morning. Almost done. So there's a lift to go up. The haven, the atrium, bunks, the mess hall, map room, the infirmary, training pit. Main deck has most of the stuff. It has the orchestrion, the shop, a forge, a redstone, and then the wall of memories. Aw, oh, bro, that's gonna be fucked up. It says Clive's Chambers, wall of memories. That is so fucked. Well, wall of memories might actually be uh, the old dude. I think the old dude might have died in the attack. That's what the wall of memories is, I'm thinking. And there's a backyard. Otto will want to know what happened in Kostnitz. I expect he'll be in the mess. Boys in school, boys, Training pit for more people to learn how to fight. Super useful. How do we get to the back? Maybe it's upstairs on the lift. It is going to be hard. It's going to be hard here in Sid every time. All's well. Yeah, let's check out all the shops and stuff. What's this? Shelves are closed. Sign outside should have told you. Yeah, the sign outside should have. Shelves. Told you. But there's no sign. The shelves, whatever that is, maybe it's a new type of shop. Um, have we any more? So, thank goodness they saved the orchestrion. <laughs> Welcome back, Sid. Order a drink, buy a round for the hall. Chat with Maeve. Who's um, Maeve? Getting on. Ah, oh, about as well as you'd expect of a barmaid pouring sour ale for penniless outlaws in the middle of the Deadlands. And it'd be worse than that if Molly here didn't make the best stew this side of stone here. Even if it is mostly just yesterday's leavings. Don't tell her you heard that from me, though. <laughs> Order a drink. Fuck it. Right Can Clive get drunk? Man, it's gulping. Don't be a stranger, Sid. Right. And everyone knows me as Sid, too, which is just really weird. <laughs> like, everyone calls you Sid. The marinade... 
To marinate yard chugabo. Just the recipe. <clears throat> this is the redstone here. Took that with us, and there's a fourth one, which we don't know what it is yet, still. Shop is right here. Oh, Karen lived. Is it business or pleasure? Ask about the past five years. Has it really been five years since you left the old place? How time flies. Like yesterday. We were all waiting to treat Sid to a hero's welcome when Koopka's lot turned up. <sighs> Not that we knew it was them. They just poured in like a plague of rats, cutting down anyone and anything that's in their way. Blood and bodies everywhere. There was a voice crying out for Sid to save us in the midst of it all. Yup. Yeah. I'll never forget those cries, try as I might. Now, Clive. Promise me you won't let anything happen like that again. Promise me that, come what may, Sid will save us. That is so fucked. Wait, Ask about the hideaway. It's even roomier than the old one was. Got my own store, my own little counter. And thanks to the lot, uh, you lot fighting the good fight, plenty of demand for me wares. Back. The only drawback is the constant bloody racket. If it's not Dory's and Otto barking their orders, it's Blackthorn and Bardolf banging away Still. day and night. If a pain in the ear holds the price I pay to be Sid, the outlaw's partner in crime, I'd say I've got myself a bargain. See what if she's got. Some, be quick about it. They've got the best blade so far, but we're probably going to get something even better with the, um, the, what do you call it? Chandler's Whispers automatically charges magic spells and maintains the charge until cast. Accessory effect will not trigger unless the ability charge magic is learned. Oh. Crimson Tassels increases limit break generation amount by 3% when dealing damage. That's not bad. Uh, let's see what else we got. Uh, Cobalt Tassels increases limit break generation by 6% when taking damage. Oh, those are both good. You get limit break like crazy. Some songs in the shop, and then just stuff you can buy. Ooh, Elixir! Instantly restores all HP. That's good. That's a good use of money. Gradually fills limit break gauge for 30 seconds. Oh, Goats! Yep, Goats is alive. Hey, you, you're back! You... You, uh, you didn't happen to run out of potions while you are away, did you? We have a fine selection of tonics and tink <clears throat> tinctures... Oh, perhaps you'd be interested in some new accoutrement. Accoutrement. Um, gear. <laughs> Fuck, I already forgot what the girl was saying. <laughs> so, uh, curatives, restoratives, and. Oh, no, no. It was like curatives, something, and restoratives. That's what he should have said. The rear stacks. This plank will have to be replaced. Maybe half the crates were lost to bandits. Like a little garden back there. It's completely new. Being on like the sea and like all the wooden like architecture around us, like the makeshift stuff, it really reminds me of like Final Fantasy X stuff. It didn't look like this or nothing, just when I think about water in Final Fantasy, I usually just remember that. Or I'll remember uh, Final Fantasy XV when you go to the Water City, that like Imperial City, that was really good. The place was fucking awesome. It was super open, had a lot of quests. Much was lost when the first hideaway fell. Colleagues and friends. Let that loss defeat us. And our work will not be in vain. It looks like that guy might not be alive anymore, the experimenter. The guy who was like obsessed with botany in the beginning, right? Because like, you would assume he'd be down here and it doesn't look like he's down here. We'll go ahead and speak to the forger and then uh, after that we'll go ahead and speak to Otto. He's right over here. Back, are you? Ask about the past five years. You've forgotten already, because I haven't. 
it was the right thing to arse getting this place into shape, especially with the mess we were in. Not that it was anything new for those of us who put the old hideaway Still. together. That doesn't mean we, I intend to do it again. <sighs> Things here ain't too bad. I suppose I've got a decent hammer, a decent anvil, and a pr uh, pre uh, pre uh, apprentice. <laughs> and knows his hammer from his cock. Oh, and the furnace is all right and all. Thanks to old Sid's bellows, the gods only know how I'd keep the coals hot enough out here uh, on the mirror without them. Jesus, I can't even speak. Not the bloody uh, not with bloody crystals, that's for sure. Nah. Now I reckon you won't find a forge like this one anywhere else in the Twins, and I count myself lucky to work with it. Thanks for keeping me on. You need anything? You give us a shout. Well, we should be able to use the forge to so make the. Oh, see, now we've got the Leaven Bolt, the Flame Tongue, Lightning Shard, and the Meteorites. Yep, let's do it. Should last you a good while. Reinforce anything? Nope. Absolutely not. Okay. Guess. Let's go and talk to Otto now. Oh wait, the wall of memory is here. There's nothing really right now, just the oath. Ah, oh, it's the crystal they stabbed together. Oh, the oath. Created the day Clive pledges allegiance to Sid. This crystal shard transfixed with twin daggers is a powerful reminder of a promise made, a friendship forged. And a legacy inherited. Wow. Yeah, that's that's fucking cute. That's actually fucking adorable, bro. No way. Uh that's fucked up. Alright. Goblin coin. I'd actually love to have that as like a fucking collector's item. I feel like they should have done that for Final Fantasy 16, right? They're like on their collector's edition, they have a fucking a crystal with the two daggers in it, and the two dad daggers are actually doubles for like letter openers or something like that. I would have taken that. I mean, now, right? You look at it like beforehand, you'd probably be like, well, "Why the fuck would I want that?" Right? <laughs> nah, bro. But I would, I would pay some money for that for sure. I'm sure someone on like Etsy or something will probably end up making that. That'd be a really cool buy. I would love that high key. Alright, let's go talk to Otto, see what's up. Sounds like he's kind of like our second in command when it comes to like running everything day to day, just like regular Sid was. Ah, oh, there you are, Clive. Word of your adventures arrived this morning. Victor sent his thanks. <laughs> I doubt Kupka will miss the force he sent to catch me. Not a single one of the bearers we saved showed any interest in coming with us. Yeah, no one cares no anymore. Seems keen to join hands with an outlaw. Any news while we were away? None worth mentioning. Gav's still off keeping an eye on the Republican army. Oh, Gav's still Should good. Be back any day now. Understood. If anyone needs me, I'll be in the map room. Oh, that reminds me. So the crystal that Gav took was the one with the daggers. Oh, shit. There's the Moogle. Still can't work that one out. There she? must be better places than the hull of a gutted airship to bury your nose in a book. Yet this is where she's chosen to be. And I'm sure she has her reasons. Let's look at the Moogle real quick. You're wondering what this new board is behind me, aren't you? All in good time, my fearless friend. All in good time. So this is going to be the bounty board, I'm assuming. The one that they teased before the game came out that it, like take up take on like dangerous monsters or something. I trust I'm not intruding. Who is this? Back from your mission. Vivian. I'm beginning to think your habit of surviving cannot be attributed to luck alone. One might say the same of you. Vivian Ninetales. Vivian Ninetales. I'll have you know that only four attempts have been made on my life. And none was especially memorable. Damn. Talking so, shit. To what do I owe the honor? Could it be that you've come for one of my lessons? <laughs> Is that so hard to believe? Very well then. Shall we start with the state of the realm? 
To absolutely no one's surprise, she finds herself at the mercy of armies and outlaws. Ah. Well, mostly armies. Though that's not for want of trying, is it, Clive? But the real question is, how did we get here? 